As boaters prepare to hit the water this Memorial Day weekend, there's a search for a body in Lake Travis that's been going on for five years. Manuel Salas was last seen by his newlywed wife struggling to swim in the lake near the oasis. We found out that after all these years, dive teams continue to look for him. Dreadful day was uh, May 5th, 2018. It was Cinco de Mayo. Manuel was just kind of a good old country boy guy. You know, we weren't drinking, uh, no alcohol, nothing. It was, you know, early in the day. Uh, we didn't know at the time that we were in anywhere between 150 to 175 foot water. He was a very strong, um, healthy, good swimmer. He says, I, you know, got to go, relieve us, got to go, got to go. And so I'm in the front pulling up the line. I turn around and when I turn around towards the back of the boat, I could see that he was in, he was in trouble. And he's like, row the, the boat. We couldn't anchor. We're drifting. So he was getting pulled under and he just never made it too. So I'm struggling to get the compartment open where the, the safe vests work. The compartment went, was stuck. I couldn't open it. By the time I got it open, grabbed a vest and shut it, it was just too late. And, you know, because his body wasn't recovered, we don't know. We don't know if it was because it was cold, because he had a heart attack, because he had a cramp, uh, because of the undertow. You know, we'll just never know. Solace is one of 10 people who went missing in Lake Travis and was never found. You can hear more of his story and the stories of other swimmers who never resurfaced on Lake Travis in our upcoming documentary. The Wake premieres on Memorial Day on KXAN and online at KXAN.com. You can learn more about the project by scanning the QR code on your screen.